Alrighty guys, so what is going on? ANC Covers here and welcome ANC Covers. Charlie Entertaining here and welcome to another reaction video. Today I'm gonna react to Tokens Um Curfew. So let's get into this. I haven't listened to this yet, so uh somebody suggested it to me, said it just came out. So let's go. Oh my god, Ronnie. My new girl is 18, still lying to her dad to see me. 1230 curfew, we'll be back, believe me. You can measure how I'm feeling just by how she treat me. So all I need is the girl so My new girl is 18, still lying to her dad to see me. 1230 curfew, we'll be back, believe me. You can measure how I'm feeling just by how she treat me. So all I need is the girl so need me. All I need Mm-hmm. Exactly. Exactly, bro. Like, I, exactly, bro. Like, gave up all the fun shit to sit inside your house and make fucking rap songs so you blew up. I don't do none of this fucking... My boss, my boss at work, he always fucking tells me that I give too much money to my dad. He tells me I give too much money to my baby mama every week. Uh, I won't tell you how much I make, but I give, uh, I give $175 to my dad, and I give, uh, I'll just say $20 a day, every day I work with, uh, my boss to my, to my baby mama. But, with the COVID-19 shit, I haven't been doing any of that recently, but nobody's been on my ass about that, which has been, which has been amazing. Also... Yeah, he tells me that I give uh, way too much money to my dad. He says I should be out partying. I should be out, you know, spending the money on bitches and shit like that. I've been spending my money on the mall, on fun shit, on me and shit like that. But I don't care about that. I'm fine with going to the mall and fucking, you know, I'm not going to the mall. Going to 7-Eleven and buying a couple dollar fucking cookies, a dollar coffee, going to McDonald's, buying a couple McChickens, buying, you know, with my paycheck. And that's it. That's all I need for the week. You know, that, 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 that to me is fun. You know what I'm saying? I don't need fucking to go buy a pair of clothes. I don't need to go buy a fucking phone. I don't need to go buy a fucking tool. I don't need to go buy all this other shit to have fun with my money. I'm trying, I'm trying to save my money as much as fucking possible. So, I'm trying to make it. Other people just fucking, they got... Fake friends, they got fucking liars, they got fucking cheaters, they got fucking fakes around them. They got fakes around them. I got nobody around me. I talked to one person online right now besides my baby mama, and she's the only person I talk to because I barely talk to my baby mama, and that's because I don't, I don't trust, I don't trust other people. I've been fucked over by too many people. I've met a ton of people since I've lived here. I've met a ton of people out on the streets who have shook my hand and talked to me when they passed me and shit like that, but I don't consider them friends at all. I have a guy who comes to my apartment and he asks for cigarettes and cigars sometimes when he doesn't have any. Uh, I don't consider him friends, but we talked about working together and shit like that. 
you know, I don't consider him a friend. I consider him a work person. You know, if he ever has work and he wants me to come out with him, he just told me he got a car. That's why he came to me because Gary, uh, my boss, sorry, I don't like to say his name out on video, but sometimes it slips out. It's going to happen. Um, my boss, he had a truck that he said he would give me $500. And this guy told me when I first met him that he was looking for a truck because he worked in construction and he was looking to go do his own jobs. So I told him if I can get him that truck, then we could go do our own stuff and shit like that. But that didn't really happen. Uh, but he got a Jeep now, so I don't know what he's doing with it. But, you know, shit happens. I just wanted to talk a little bit to give this video a couple more, you know, seconds on the... On the playtime, because it, it, this video is only 3 minutes and 20 seconds long, so I wanted to add a little bit of context in here because of what he just said. I'm going to go back so you can re-listen to it. I'll go back 20 seconds so you can re-listen to it. Yep. I hope that ain't it. sucks the song is good but i wanted another verse because i hated how much the chorus was repeated in this song Okay. Was definitely a good song. I mean, um, was definitely a good song. There are obviously probably some things that went over my head. I'm currently not wearing headphones. I'm not using a speaker. My phone is turned up all the way. I don't know. I don't know. I can't hear it too well, but uh, there was definitely some good lines in there. Like I said, I paused it during one point to tell you that uh, it said, remind me of the youth I gave up for this rap shit because he didn't you know when he was in college he didn't go to parties and do drugs and drink alcohol and fucking shit like that so it was definitely a good song it definitely has a good message to it so um well some good messages to it i don't know about uh yeah, a new girl being 18 and two uh still lying to her dad twelve thirty curfew so like that. I mean, well, if you're 18, technically you should be able to be out as long as you want. You are in the United States. Um, so if a girl wanted to lie to her dad to stay out past curfew uh, for her dad, her strict dad, then she could do that, no problem. Um, so look forward to enjoy and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. If you have any token songs, Hobson songs, NF songs, Tom McDonald songs. I'm saying that because Tom McDonald compared all of them in one of his songs. If you have any of those types of rappers, if you have anybody who sends a message, any like a new person that sends a message, I heard the baby is a good rapper. Um, if you guys know any of his songs that have a strong message to it, let me know it in the comment section down below so I can cover it. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Look forward to enjoy, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to turn on post notifications so you know every time I upload a video. And check out Solely Entertainment TV on YouTube because he's doing fucking awesome.